For Yadira Arroyo's family, this sentencing is a long time coming. 31-year-old Jose Gonzalez was convicted of first-degree murder in connection to her death back in March, and today he will be sentenced here in the Bronx. Through ups and downs, anger, despair, emotion, agony. 44-year-old Radira Arroyo had spent 14 years as an FDNY EMT and was a mother of five when she was killed. When her killer was convicted last month, her family and friends called it a relief. But we finally did it, right? Yeah. Yeah. Investigators say Arroyo was in her ambulance near Watson Avenue at White Plains Road in March 2017. She got out of the ambulance when she was alerted that Jose Gonzalez was riding the ambulance's back bumper and of a robbery he was involved in. Gonzalez then jumped into the driver's seat and reversed it into Arroyo. She was pinned under the truck and dragged through an intersection before the ambulance crashed. She died shortly after. A mother, a mother of five sons working a, a, a great job and a great career and to be taken away like that was just so unfair. Six years is a long time, but as long as the verdict was correct and we got justice, I don't care how long it took. Gonzalez originally pleaded not guilty, but was later deemed unfit to stand trial. Last of all, health officials determined him to be no longer an incapacitated person, and the case continued. At the conviction, the union that represents FDNY EMS spoke about the dangers first responders face every day while on the job. Our EMTs and paramedics go out there day in and day out to help and save the public. EMT Adira served this city as a hero, and she died serving the city as a hero. Today's sentencing will take place at 10 this morning. In the Concourse Village section of the Bronx, Kieran Dillon, PIX11 News. Kieran,